Welcome back everybody to another three Atari games. And first up is Sword Quest. So for this actual video, it's gonna be all Sword Quest, all the, the whole trilogy. Um I'm not I have no idea how to play them. I know you need like the handbook, right? If you uh if you wanted to uh know like uh, uh how, what to do, because this is all based off on uh Easter eggs and shit like that, Easter egg hunting, and if you like found them all you got this grand prize of like a, a sword like a golden sword if i'm correct and like a chalice and like uh shit i forgot the, the third one but i'll have it posted up right here but if you found them all you went played in this tournament and then if you win that then you got this grand prize of a sword and like a like i think a bunch of money and shit like that so this is what i meant i think i talked about it a while ago for my space invader uh space invader game uh that um Tournaments like this just doesn't happen. This is crazy. Imagine playing this game, having to go through your uh, handbook and through, doing all this stuff, submitting your shit in, and then you get uh, selected to do a tournament like this. You compete for uh, uh, um, this championship, sword quest, golden sword, golden chalice, golden, like all this shit. It's like, damn, this is crazy. The one thing is these games are fucking trash. I think they are. Maybe to other people. Since, you know, they did this whole tournament and they love it and all this shit. <sighs> yeah. But I I have no idea what I'm doing. I swear to fucking God. Like I said, without the book that tells you the code and like what you get, I have no idea what I'm doing. So let's go ahead and jump into it and you'll see what I mean. Okay. So, uh, I... Uh, <laughs> that's what I mean. I don't, I have no clue what I'm doing. Is this like what I'm dropping off? I, I, do you have to match it? It's like a matching game. I, like I said, no fucking clue. I know like one time I was playing, I was just like, like that. Game, that's it. And then you start over. <laughs> I swear to God, I don't know what I'm doing. Look, I'll go again. Okay, and I know you don't like, okay, so. Do I take the dot? Do you have to guess which one to take, I guess? I, I don't know. Okay, so I um Okay, and so now there's this and the controllers just are fucking trash. Okay, so you can't touch those. What if I go up again now? Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, oh. Fucking shit. Alright. Oh. Okay, so there's random things to do in them. Fuck. Fuck. Shit. Oh my god. And what if I back... Come on. Fuck. It's not like the controllers are, like, that good, so it's not like... Like, you see, I'm clicking to move and it doesn't move. Fuck. Like I said, I, I have no idea what I'm doing. I don't even know if this does anything. Oh. Okay. 
So is it to collect all the items? Did I beat? No, we're not doing that again. Did I beat it then the first time? Was, was that the whole thing of it? Well, now what? Okay. Like I said, I have no idea what I'm doing. Oh, oh. I have no idea. Um. But that's Sword Quest. We're gonna go and move on to the next one. See? If that's any different. I doubt it. Let's go ahead. Alright, you guys. So the next one is called Sword Quest uh, Fire World. The other one is called Earth World. So they are all called Sword Quest, and it's like Earth World, uh, Fire World, and uh, Water World. So let's see if this is any different. Oh, God. The graphics just look like it got worse. Okay. Nope. I... What am I? I can make it go faster? What the fuck? What am I doing? Oh my god. I don't even know. What the fuck? I... I, I I have no idea what I'm doing, you guys. Like, and once again, the controllers are just so bad. Oh my god! <laughs> Fucking shit! Let's see what this one does. What? Are they all the same shit? Oh, I was killing it. Woo! <laughs> I don't even know what I'm doing, though. Oh, my God. Anyways, <laughs> that's Fire World. <laughs> let's, let's just go ahead and move on to the next one, you guys. All right, you guys. So, like I said, the next one is called Sword Quest Water World. Okay, let's go ahead and start it. Okay, we're just dodging sharks. Oh. Okay. Can I pick these up? Oh, I can pick up the shoes. Okay. Okay. Uh, is this level two? Is that what it means? Pick up something or okay. Oh. oh, it's like Frogger, but fucking worse. Oh my god! Oh. I, I didn't even do anything. Did I beat it? Oh, fucking what well, so if you beat it you get an item is that what happens cuz I can't pick up shit Okay, let's move on to the next one That's the sharks again What is I, every time I click the button, it it sends me to another place. Is that skipping the level or what the fuck is going on? I'm on level four now, but I don't. It's the same shit. Okay. Okay, so I got it. Okay. 
Did I win? Oh, okay. Gotta go. What the fuck? You didn't let me pick it up before. Okay, I'm now I'm stuck, so I don't know if I beat it. <laughs> I have no idea. Um uh, well yeah, there you guys go. That's all three sword quests. I know, like I said, there's people out there that play this shit and like they get into it, they know what they're doing, they know all about it, and they can you know, they 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 grew up on this. You know, they went out there, they were playing it all the time. And they, they had the handbook. You know, this is the kind of games that they had at the, at the moment. They didn't have like, uh, Xbox or PlayStation or Nintendo where you can have like, um, detailed stories and like where to go and what to do. This is what they had. No story, no nothing. Just get into it and figure it out yourself. There was no internet like that. And there wasn't accessible, at least if, if I recall, you know, I mean, Google wasn't even really around. I think it went until like 2003 and YouTube was like 2007 2008 so around there that's when those things <laughs> were there so these people had to figure it out themselves i think they had to use like fucking uh magazines if not magazines they had to use like uh, uh what is it, like those phone call places or call toll, toll numbers or whatever they're called um to get help or figure it out by asking someone else other than that, you had to have the note, uh, the handbook. You had to have that to understand how to play the game. You needed all this stuff. You needed all, all of it. Obviously, I don't have any of that, so I can't really get to it. But it doesn't change the fact that this game was revolutionary in its way. Just the fact that they had this, uh, this high end, you know, championship for this game. You know, they had this tournament or champion, whatever you want to call it, and you know, you were able to win these really, really expensive grand, uh, grand prizes. You know, that's pretty crazy. Off of this game, which you just saw me play, they had grand prizes like that. Like, that's fucking wild. You know, we don't really do shit like that anymore. So, but the imagination you needed to have to be able to understand how to play some of these games. Like, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Maybe with the notebook, it'll tell me what the boots do, what the crown does, what the key does, what whatever the cross, if that's a cross, you know, maybe it'll tell me. But I don't know. I mean, to me, like I said, I don't like this game. I mean, maybe I would have liked it if I was actually in that tournament and been like, yo, I got something to win, but I don't. So this is what, uh, what it is. Anyways, if you guys enjoyed this video, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye. We are the dreamers of dreams. <laughs>